welcome to today's video. Today I'm going to share a recipe with you that can help you to get rid of hyperpigmentation on the skin such as blackheads, whitehead, acne scars and any form of blemishes. Now this will also help to tighten and firm the skin and the bonus to this recipe is that it will also help to lighten that skin. Getting rid of the hyperpigmentation on the skin will leave your skin much cleaner looking and much clearer looking. So if you're interested in today's video, continue watching. Now let's take a look at the ingredients. Our first ingredient is carrots. I'm also going to be using egg. I'm also going to be using some turmeric powder. And along with this, I'm going to use some grapeseed oil. Now let's talk about the ingredients a little. Now for the carrot, it contains beta carotene and carrot also have vitamin A, which is known to help to firm and tighten the skin. Vitamin A is basically retinol and retinol is great for the aging skin. It's going to help to boost the collagen production. Our second ingredient is egg and egg is a wonderful ingredient for firming and tightening the skin. And we also have our turmeric powder which is known to help to brighten and lighten the skin. Turmeric powder is also great for acne, pimples, blackheads, whatever impurity you have on the skin, using turmeric powder will help to get rid of most of the impurities. Our next ingredient which is the grapeseed oil is loaded with vitamin E and vitamin E is going to help to moisturize the skin, it's going to penetrate deep in the skin without leaving it greasy. Therefore if you have oil skin this is a wonderful oil to use however it is perfect for most skin type now for this recipe I'm only going to be using the egg yolk and take a look at this to get the egg yolk just open your egg and separate the yolk from the white next I'm going to move on to preparing the carrot and I'm going to wash and chop the carrot since I'm going to be blending if you do not have a blender just wash and grate the carrot Now the carrot tend to be a little hard, so I'm going to actually add a little bit of water to the carrot, not a lot. If you have a juicer and you choose to juice, that is even better since juicing the carrot, you will not need to add any water to this. So here is the chopped carrots and now I'm going to transfer this to the blender. So I'm pouring in about three tablespoons of water to a medium carrots, not a lot. And now I'm gonna blend. And here is our blended carrot, and now we're gonna strain. All we need is our carrot juice for this recipe. So here are the four ingredients all together. Here is the turmeric powder, the grapeseed oil, the egg yolk, and the carrot juice. So now we are going to put these together. Now here we have the egg yolk reaching for the carrot juice. You want to give it a stir. And we're going to use two tablespoons of the fresh carrot juice. And this is just a little extra, just pour that in. I'm gonna use one teaspoon of the grapeseed oil. If you do not have grapeseed oil, go ahead and use some coconut oil or some olive oil. Almond oil is also good. Reaching for the turmeric powder. I'm using a half of a teaspoon of turmeric powder. If you have fresh turmeric, go ahead and use that. And I'm adding this to it. Next, I'm going to take a plastic fork and I'm going to whisk this together. Just whisk. Just blend well. Now, this is not a thick mask. This is a very liquefied mask. So you're going to apply this in thin layers. And the reason why I'm whisking so long, we're trying to make sure everything is totally blend and here we have it this is our skin tightening
facial mask that is going to lighten and brighten the skin is also going to get rid of your acne is going to clear the skin from all the dark spots and blemishes while firming the skin so now i'm going to show you how to use this on your skin so here we have the facial mask and before you apply this facial mask you want to start with clean skin so you're going to wash your face the way you normally do and then you're ready for the facial mask now it's best to wash your face with a little warm water before in that way it will open the pores now to apply this facial mask i'm going to be using a brush for easier application if you do not have a brush go ahead and use a cotton pad or any soft cotton cloth that that you have so you want to make sure to stir and now because we have turmeric in this you got to be careful because turmeric does stay in your clothing so be careful that it doesn't drop on your clothes so and you're gonna apply a very thin layer to the skin and you're gonna apply it upwards like I'm showing here so just apply this And you're doing this all over your face. Make sure to cover the area around your mouth where you tend to have the wrinkles and the fine lines. Now when it comes on to the laugh line, I like to just dab this in it like that both of the laugh lines to stab it up and then you just brush it upwards all the way to the tip of your hair now when it comes on to the forehead I like to apply this upwards also If you have dark under eye circles, this is great. Just watch how this is gonna get rid of my dark under eye circles also. Those blackheads, make sure to dab this on your nose. And now, this is it. I'm gonna sit with this. This is definitely tightening the skin. I'm definitely feeling this. So I'm gonna sit with this for about 30 minutes. And then I'm gonna come back and I'm gonna show you what it looks like after 30 minutes. And then I'm gonna rinse off and I'm gonna show you the result. Now I have been sitting with this for about 30 minutes and take a look at what happened. In spite of the fact that this mask is so thin, it's definitely gonna dry on the skin. You could touch it so it's dry enough for you to touch. Now, what is happening, it is definitely tightening my skin. So, I'm gonna rinse this off and I'm gonna come back and I'm gonna show you my result. Okay guys, so I am back and take a look at my skin. Check my under eyes out. It is definitely lighter. This is really an awesome facial mask. Now my skin is feeling soft and smooth. And what I'm going to do next, I'm going to apply my favorite moisturizer to my skin. As a matter of fact, I'm going to use one of my personal oil blend and I'm just going to massage my skin with this. So you need to do the same once you rinse your facial mask off. Now you want to use this at least twice per week for best result. When you're done with this facial mask, your skin is still going to feel tight. Not to worry, that is okay. Like right now, I'm feeling the tightness on my skin still. 
that is actually wonderful now splash on some toner if you use a facial toner and then grab your moisturizer or your facial serum and apply it to the skin massage it into the skin now make sure to do some facial massages while you apply your oil or your moisturizer to the skin to further enhance that wonderful younger looking you So there you have it thank you all for watching now if you like this video just give it a thumbs up because it's really up the channel and leave your comments those are also welcome and helpful and if this was your first time watching look below you're gonna see the word subscribe just click on it and you will be subscribed at the side there's also a little bell if you click on that you will get a notification as soon as I upload a video thank you all for watching and I'll see you in my next video bye bye